With the following critical incident video, the Fresno Police Department is sharing information about an officer-involved shooting that occurred on Sunday, July 30th, 2023. Our goal with critical incident videos is to be transparent with our community and share as much information as we are able to when critical incidents such as this one occur. The following critical incident video provides an overview of the incident and includes body-worn camera footage and 911 recordings. Due to the graphic nature of this video, viewer discretion is advised. At 10.32 a.m., Fresno Police Officer Number 1 was in the 100 block of East Warner Avenue where a car had been abandoned in the roadway. Officer Number 1 was in the process of having the vehicle towed when a citizen approached and said there was a young male on a scooter nearby that had a gun. Officer Number 1 alerted dispatch to the report. For Adam 11. For Adam 11. I'm stuck here with this tow right now, but I've been advised by a citizen that possibly a uh, young gentleman on a scooter in the area of McGill and Blackstone, possibly armed with a handgun. I got the impression it was one of those, um, uh, not, a, um, not a motorized scooter. Copy. I don't have any other description other than a, a young man, possibly uh, with a handgun. Copy. Do you want to call me up in an area check? Uh, yeah, start a unit that way. In fact, there's a, I see a gentleman on a uh, scooter now on FB and McGill. Stand by. Officer number one drove southbound on North Effie Street and made contact with the subject. The subject was wearing a ski mask that nearly covered his entire face when officer number one approached. Officer number one ordered him to raise his hands and get down on his knees. The subject got down on his knees and then reached for an object in his waistband. Officer number one told him to get your hands up. The subject continued to reach for the object. The subject pulled a gun from his waistband while saying, it's a, it's a, it's a BB. Simultaneously, officer number one discharged his service weapon. Get your hands up. A, stop. A, stop. Four Adam 11, I got shots fired. Four Adam 11. I'm gonna need uh, traffic blocked off at McGill and Effie. Also, McGill and uh, Warner. I'm sorry, Effie and Warner. Start me equipment code three. Start me uh, units and uh, supervisor, please. Paramedics were immediately cleared to enter the scene and the subject was transported to the hospital. It was determined later that he was a 15-year-old juvenile. At the time of this video, he is listed in stable condition and is expected to recover from his injury. Officer number one recovered the juvenile's unloaded Glock 19X .177 caliber BB pistol. The weapon is a replica of a Glock semi-automatic handgun with all Glock stampings. The juvenile was cited for PC 417.4, brandishing an imitation firearm, and released to the custody of his guardian. This concludes the critical incident video of the officer-involved shooting that occurred on July 30th, 2023. The investigation into this critical incident is ongoing.